I give you the future of electricity. Alternating current. Nikola Tesla, the renowned genius who remains shrouded in mystery. His innovations transformed technology as we know it, though much about this master inventor remains unknown. Other people were capitalizing on his work without giving him proper credit, and he was suffering from mental illness. Upon his passing, shocking revelations came to light, suggesting depths to Tesla yet unrealized. Join us as we reveal 15 shocking secrets about Tesla, only revealed after he passed away. Nikola Tesla had a vision of what's to come into the future. Number 15, Death Ray. Among the most startling revelations that came to light following Nikola Tesla's death was the disclosure of his theoretical particle beam, Death Ray. Throughout his life, Tesla had cryptically alluded to developing a directed energy weapon, capable of delivering destruction across incredible distances. While he never produced a functioning prototype, his repeated assertions that such a device was technologically feasible shook the scientific community. In multiple interviews given in his later years, Tesla claimed he had been working on a method for projecting concentrated beams of microscopic charged particles at tremendous velocities over hundreds of miles. He described blasting targets with enough energy to equal millions of pounds of TNT, enabling a single operator to obliterate entire fleets of 10,000 enemy airplanes. Tesla insisted that properly engineered, such a weapon system would end all war by offering impenetrable defensive protection around a nation's borders. Tesla often dramatically referred to his conceptual armament as a death beam or teleforce. While he promoted it as a means of preventing war rather than causing mass destruction, the proposed capabilities sounded virtually unbelievable. No existing technology at the time could feasibly accelerate subatomic particles to such incredible speeds or maintain cohesion and focus over hundreds of miles of atmosphere. Yet Tesla repeatedly claimed before his death that the fundamental science was sound and well within reach. Mainstream scientists dismissed many of Tesla's pronouncements surrounding the death ray as exaggerated showmanship, not grounded in demonstrable reality. After his passing, no prototypes, blueprints, or other records outlining the particle beam weapon were recovered among Tesla's belongings. The absence of tangible evidence seemed to conclusively debunk Tesla's supposed technological feat as nothing more than a fanciful notion. However, much intrigue and debate still linger over what exactly Tesla may have conceived in his most visionary moments. Some suggest his talk of shooting down airplanes actually described early theorizing about particle beams and plasma weaponry, which resonates more with modern concepts than magic death rays. While Tesla clearly indulged in dramatic hyperbole when promoting his ideas, he also had a track record of making breakthroughs far ahead of his time. Much like with his other radical claims of wireless power transmission, perhaps his prophecies of directed energy weapons simply awaited the right technological conditions in order to transform from vision into reality. Number 14. The Omen of Tesla's Electrical Birth On a stormy night in July 1856, the brilliant mind of Nikola Tesla entered the world amidst chaotic flashes of lightning tearing across the skies over his birthplace in Smiljan, Croatia. The local midwife attending his birth declared the tempestuous weather an ominous sign that the infant Tesla would become a child of darkness. But his mother Juka Mandik rejected this grim prophecy. She insisted instead that her son would grow up to be a child of light, destined to illuminate the entire world with his brilliance. Her faith proved remarkably prescient. Young Nikola displayed an early affinity for learning and technology. His uncanny memory and visualization abilities enabled him to construct intricate devices and solve problems entirely in his head without needing to draw diagrams. During Tesla's formative years, his mother encouraged his interest in science and supported his inventiveness however she could. She also emphasized values of humanism that helped shape Tesla's focus on creating technology to uplift society. Tesla's lifelong appreciation for the beauty and power of electrical forces also traced back to his childhood. At age 12, he became entranced after watching a demonstration of a direct current electric motor. From that moment forward, 
he dedicated himself to mastering the secrets of electricity. Tesla came to view the lightning storm marking his birth not as a bad omen, but as a sign of destiny linking him to this thrilling phenomenon that would define his life's work. While the local midwife saw darkness in the tempest, Tesla's mother looked into the newborn's eyes and saw endless potential for light. Her faith was rewarded in the form of her brilliant son, who fulfilled her prophecy that he would grow up to be not a child of darkness, but a child of light, one who illuminated the entire world. Number 13. The Turbulent Trajectory of Tesla's Early Innovations Nikola Tesla's genius was evident from an early age. His uncanny ability to visualize intricate mechanical systems and perform complex calculations mentally marked him as a gifted youth. After studying electrical engineering at university, Tesla's early career followed a brilliant yet turbulent trajectory of innovations and setbacks. At just 24 years old, Tesla became the chief electrician for the Budapest Telephone Exchange in Hungary. He quickly established himself by pioneering major improvements to telephony systems. This included developing an amplifier to boost telephone signals across longer distances, allowing calls between Budapest and Vienna. He also introduced novel duplex and triplex transmission modes, enabling multiple calls simultaneously on one line. However, Tesla's early success was followed by a complete physical and mental collapse in his mid-twenties. His obsessive personality caused him to push himself to a breaking point. He began experiencing disturbing hallucinations, insomnia and hypersensitivity to light and sound. For months, he was unable to continue any work and his future seemed uncertain. But after a period of rest and recovery, Tesla regained his composure and relocated to Paris in 1882. There, he went to work for the Continental Edison Company and returned to his impressive innovations. He designed critical enhancements to direct current electrical generators, motors, and arc lighting systems. His superiors took note of this brilliant young engineer who seemed destined to make his mark on the burgeoning age of electricity. Number 12. Unexplained Extraterrestrial Signals Nikola Tesla, the renowned inventor and electricity pioneer, made a startling claim in 1899 that sent shockwaves through the scientific community. While testing equipment that year in Colorado Springs, Tesla observed peculiar unexplained signals that he concluded could not possibly have originated on Earth. Tesla tentatively speculated that these mysterious transmissions were communications being sent by extraterrestrial life, perhaps even an alien civilization. At the time, Tesla had been conducting pioneering experiments involving wireless electrical discharges created by his enormous high-voltage Tesla coil transformer. On several occasions, Tesla picked up what he described as regular and strong signals of unknown origin, consisting of a sharp ticking sound, unlike any earthly sources he could identify. The implication seemed obvious to him. He had received communications not from across our planet, but across the void of space. Tesla mentioned these anomalous signals briefly to reporters, stating, I can never forget the first sensations I experienced when it dawned upon me that I had observed something possibly of incalculable consequences to mankind. He seemed to believe the evidence pointed conclusively to intelligent life elsewhere in the cosmos trying to contact humanity. However, Tesla did not publicly speculate any further at the time, realizing the controversial nature of such an extraordinary claim. Unfortunately, Tesla lacked the equipment and data necessary to properly analyze the mysterious signals and definitively determine their origin. Number 11. Tesla's Visionary Turbine Engine Few innovators could claim the same astounding ability to accurately envision the future of technology decades in advance as Nikola Tesla. Among his multitude of groundbreaking inventions was the Tesla Turbine, an elegantly simple rotary engine design that seemed mundane at first glance yet held revolutionary promise. Instead of utilizing complex blades and vanes like traditional turbine engines, Tesla's novel design employed smooth metal discs stacked in parallel, with spaces in between allowing fluid to flow around the edges. This configuration generated torque not through blades biting the fluid, but by viscosity and the boundary layer effect as the fluid flowed between the discs. 
The absence of protruding parts meant far less drag and turbulence than bladed turbines, allowing extraordinarily high rotational speeds above 30,000 RPM and unmatched energy efficiency. Tesla also speculated that such disks could last practically indefinitely if made of sufficiently rigid material. While his contemporaries struggled to comprehend the purpose of such an unusual engine with apparently no meaningful benefits, Tesla, as usual, saw far into the future. He envisioned his turbine revolutionizing power generation and also providing lightweight, compact propulsion for aircraft, cars, and boats at unheard of efficiencies. Where others perceived uselessness, Tesla's visionary mind recognized the virtually limitless potential. Modern analysis has validated many of Tesla's assertions about the merits of his turbine design. Engine experts now acknowledge it as an elegantly simple and robust system that converts fluid energy into torque more efficiently than bladed turbines could ever achieve. As materials science has advanced, Engineers have finally been able to implement durable Tesla turbines that reach phenomenal speeds and endure extreme stresses. The merits Tesla claimed surrounding his revolutionary engine concept have largely come to fruition, even if widespread adoption still lies ahead. Number 10. Tesla's Exploration of Mechanical Earthquake Generation Delving into the more controversial chapters of Nikola Tesla's research endeavors, we come upon his conjectures involving the mechanical generation of earthquakes. Through his pioneering electrical innovations involving motors and resonance, Tesla became fascinated by the natural vibrational frequencies of the Earth itself. Never one to restrain his boundless curiosity, he began exploring a tantalizing hypothesis, whether artificial means might be created to produce seismic vibrations matching those of earthquakes. Tesla theorized that by carefully determining the most conducive frequencies, an apparatus could be designed that would resonate with the Earth's own harmonic vibrations. Such a device could induce tremors, or with sufficient power, potentially even trigger major seismic events. He was adamant that earthquakes were caused by pulsations produced within Earth's mass, rather than pressures from tectonic shifts. Reproducing such pulsations mechanically, he believed, would recreate the effects of natural earthquakes in precise locations. During his time in New York, Tesla claimed to have tested a small mechanical oscillator device of his own invention that produced intense vibrations in his Manhattan laboratory, allegedly causing shaking and alarming nearby residents. Though seemingly dangerous, Tesla considered such tests necessary to refine his earthquake-generating concepts. He envisioned that properly controlled mechanical oscillations could relieve stress building along fault lines, thus preventing major quakes from building up. Most seismologists today dismiss Tesla's theories of mechanically generated earthquakes as unrealistic and fearsome in their potential risks if misused. Number 9. The Philadelphia Experiment Among the most bizarre tales associated with Nikola Tesla involves the apocryphal Philadelphia Experiment a supposedly catastrophic military test conducted by the U.S. Navy in 1943 meant to achieve electromagnetic invisibility and teleportation effects on the destroyer escort USS Eldridge. While no credible evidence supports the most sensationalized claims around this alleged event, some have tried linking Tesla's advanced research to the myth due to purported similarities with his wireless transmission concepts. However, the direct connections to Tesla remain tenuous speculation at best. According to accounts that began circulating years after Tesla's death, the Navy was rumored to be developing a top-secret project inspired by Tesla's work with radio waves, resonance, and electromagnetic fields. The most extraordinary version states that during initial testing, the Eldridge not only turned invisible, but actually teleported instantaneously from Philadelphia to Norfolk and back again. Crew members were said to have become embedded in the ship's structure during the bizarre events. While fantastical, no official records or credible first-hand witnesses have ever corroborated these allegations. The Office of Naval Research did declassify a project called Project Rainbow, undertaken in Philadelphia in 1943. However, this dealt only with standard degaussing techniques to reduce the magnetic signatures of ships against mines. Tesla's pioneering of oscillating electromagnetic fields may have influenced such research. 
but no tangible evidence links him to invisibility studies. A more likely genesis is that the apocryphal experiment evolved from rumors surrounding conventional degaussing tests, eventually morphing into an urban legend. While Tesla's legacy and visionary concepts certainly inspired speculative fiction, no substantive ties link him directly to the myths around the Philadelphia experiment. Nevertheless, the persistence of such outrageous stories does highlight the mystique and intrigue that surrounds Tesla's trailblazing work, exploring the frontiers of electromagnetism and high-frequency physics. Number 8. Global Wireless Power Few ambitions consumed Nikola Tesla more entirely than his lifelong quest to develop a system for wireless power transmission that could send electricity around the globe through the air itself without any connecting wires. To demonstrate his revolutionary vision and share free power with the world, Tesla embarked on his greatest project, the construction of Wardenclyffe Tower on Long Island, New York between 1901 and 1917. Sourcing crucial funding from financier J.P. Morgan, Tesla began work on the magnificent 57-meter tower topped with a conductive dome. Tesla intended for Wardenclyffe to function as a giant transmitter, beaming both power and communications across the Atlantic using the Earth itself as a conductive medium for his electricity. His grandiose plan was no less than establishing a world wireless system for instant global communication, unlimited free energy, and ushering humanity into a technological utopia. Tesla proclaimed grandly that Wardenclyffe would enable one to transmit intelligent signals and even power to any distance without wires, and that electrical energy can be perfectly applied for ideal purposes globally. But as costs at Wardenclyffe mounted exponentially, Morgan withdrew support by 1905, leaving the project unable to be completed. With no way to cover the soaring expenses, Tesla lost Wardenclyffe and was forced to abandon his ambitious wireless transmission vision altogether. Though Tesla's tower failed to fulfill his dream and was raised for scrap in 1917, it highlighted his trailblazing nature as an inventor far ahead of his time. While wireless power transmission on a global scale remained an unrealized ideal for Tesla, the concepts he pioneered underpin modern wireless charging technologies on a far smaller scale. From inductive charging pads to solar-powered lamps, the possibilities Tesla recognized are finally becoming realized over a century later, proving that his innovation simply required sufficient technological advances to be implemented. Number 7. Ancient Pyramids as Power Plants Among his many forward-thinking interests, Nikola Tesla held a deep fascination with the Great Pyramids of Egypt and speculated that they once served as gigantic power plants, not mere pharaonic tombs. Intrigued by the pyramid's dimensions, internal passages, and unusual composition, Tesla hypothesized that they had been designed to tap into the natural resonant frequencies of Earth and focus its electric currents for energy transmission purposes. Tesla noticed that the Great Pyramid's height of 481 feet matched almost exactly the average height of land above sea level globally, suggesting geoelectrical significance. Furthermore, the presence of disparate layers of insulating limestone and conducting granite in its construction appeared purposeful to Tesla, who compared it to an enormous electrical capacitor storing and amplifying Earth's currents. Tesla also recognized similarities between the pyramid's internal tunnels, strategically directed towards celestial bodies and his own experiments in Colorado, where he wirelessly lit lamps from miles away by tuning to the upper atmosphere's resonant frequency. Such synchronicities led Tesla to conclude the ancient structures were advanced technological installations designed to accumulate charge and resonance in ways modern science was only beginning to grasp in his time. While most Egyptologists consider the pyramid power plant theory pseudoscientific speculation, Tesla's expertise with electromagnetism and resonance gives his analysis real merit. Recent scans have detected anomalous electromagnetic signatures within the pyramids, adding plausibility. Tesla's insights suggest the established historical understanding of pyramids may ignore or underestimate their technological sophistication. Though the details are still uncertain, his work lends credibility to the provocative idea that the pyramids were originally built as some kind of prehistoric power plant through ingenious manipulation of Earth's energies. 
Number 6. Dynamic Theory of Gravity Of all the mysteries and forces of nature that occupied Nikola Tesla's boundless mind, none consumed him more than discovering the secrets of gravity. He firmly believed that gravity did not actually stem from the mass as described by Newton, but instead was an energy field that could be manipulated with technology. These convictions led Tesla to develop an entirely novel dynamic theory of gravity with world-changing implications if fully elucidated. Rather than accepting gravity as a fundamental property of mass, Tesla theorized it was actually a manifestation of electrostatic force. He speculated all matter radiates some version of this mysterious energetic force that mutually attracts objects possessing mass. By artificially replicating electrostatic force fields through technological means, Tesla hypothesized that the conventional effects of gravity could be overridden, even to the point of generating levitation. To support his theories, Tesla claimed to have developed small-scale prototype devices as far back as the 1890s, demonstrating gravity nullification and influencing interactions between objects. He described using rotating magnetic fields to interfere with the force between metallic disks, diodes, and plates placed at varying distances. However, Tesla never published full details of his experiments and prototypes. The confirmation that Tesla pursued an entirely different conceptual model of gravity with such conviction has shaken the foundational pillars of modern physics. Yet Tesla's work also opens new vistas of possibility still being explored. Could Tesla's vision lead to anti-gravity spacecraft, tractor beams, exotic propulsion systems, or new limitless clean energy sources by engineering gravity fields? The potential flowing from Tesla's revolutionary concepts remains as immense as his brilliance. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. The genius Nikola Tesla was consumed by an audacious quest to build a time machine. He toiled in secrecy for years in a single-minded pursuit to defy the very laws of nature. Tesla stubbornly worked to accomplish what no inventor before him could, convinced he could unlock the secrets of time travel. Nikola Tesla breaks silence before his death and reveals terrifying secret. He said that he could see the past, present, and future together. Was this the rambling of a deteriorating mind? Or had Tesla's obsession borne fruit, giving him access to a realm beyond our comprehension? Some suggest the frail Tesla seen in photos later in life was not the man he claimed to be, but rather a visitor from another epoch. The extent of Tesla's success remains uncertain, but we are left to wonder, could Tesla have gazed into the future he dreamed of? Let us know your thoughts on this in the comments below. Number 5. Tesla's Numerological Obsession One of the more unusual facets of Nikola Tesla's prolific genius was his fixation with numerology and the sequence of the numbers 3, 6, and 9, which he deemed of deep significance in understanding the universe's inner workings. Through countless experiments over the years, Tesla became obsessed with these numbers, convinced they represented the essential vibrational frequencies of nature itself. Tesla described the number 3 as encapsulating the spiritual and creative driving force pervading the material plane. Six, on the other hand, symbolized the physical universe defined by three dimensions. The product of three and two six embodied duality. Finally, nine for Tesla represented the synthesis of physical and spiritual planes, the sum of three and six. By the 1930s, Tesla had become consumed with the notion that these three digits formed the primary vibrational rates manifest throughout creation. He insisted that 369 fundamentally regulated all material processes and properties. Tesla also believed invoking these vibrations through mystical practices like numerology could unlock profound revelations and enhance creativity or health. Mainstream science regarded Tesla's fixation on 369 as an eccentric obsession reflecting his growing detachment from conventional viewpoints. However, some esoteric scholars have noted that ancient spiritual traditions also placed mystical significance on these particular numbers, which may have informed Tesla's numerological theories. While the ultimate meaning behind Tesla's 369 obsession remains ambiguous, it exemplified his unconventional perspective of the cosmos. Number 4. The Unexplained Confiscation of Tesla's Papers 
The circumstances surrounding visionary inventor Nikola Tesla's death have fueled intense speculation for decades. Upon Tesla's passing at the age of 86 in January 1943, agents of the Federal Bureau of Investigation promptly arrived at Tesla's room in the New Yorker Hotel and seized all his belongings, fueling suspicions that his effects contained valuable suppressed inventions. The government frequently confiscated assets and patents belonging to foreign nationals during wartime to prevent critical technologies from aiding enemy regimes. But why the immediate seizure of all Tesla's papers and prototypes so soon after his death? As a naturalized American citizen, Tesla's property was technically exempt from direct confiscation. The government's rush to place such an iron grip on Tesla's effects led many to believe critical discoveries remained among his papers. Revelations that certain officials preferred to keep hidden from public view. Wild speculation proliferated about what exactly the government had so promptly removed from Tesla's possession and secured away in classified vaults. Some suggested the cache of information delved into dangerous new realms of physics, weapons research, or power generation that officials feared could shift the post-war balance if released. Others proposed that designs for revolutionary technologies like anti-gravity spacecraft, death ray devices, or limitless clean energy sources were confiscated to suppress their society-altering ramifications. More extreme theories even claimed Tesla's papers contained contact with extraterrestrial life. While such fanciful conjecture exceeds the available evidence, the lack of transparency surrounding what was actually found in Tesla's confiscated files continues to breed uncertainty. Until more facts come to light, the mystery endures over what potentially earth-shaking insights this trailblazing futurist still had up his sleeve in the final days of his enigmatic life. The answers slipped away along with the truckloads of Tesla's belongings whisked into unseen government vaults, never to be fully revealed. Though Tesla's body expired alone in room 3327, the light of his boundary-shattering ideas may still glow somewhere in the darkness of suppressed knowledge. Number 3. The Spiritual Bond Between Tesla and His Pigeon Among the most unexpected relationships to arise during the latter part of Nikola Tesla's life was the deep affinity and sense of understanding he came to share with an injured white female pigeon. As Tesla withdrew from the public eye in his final decade, spending much of his time alone tending to injured birds in New York parks, one particular pigeon formed a unique connection with the aging scientist. Tesla showed great compassion towards this specific bird after noticing her injured wing and leg one day in the park. He gently took her back to his hotel room and tenderly nursed her back to health over the following weeks. The bird displayed unusual gentleness and intelligence in her gaze, captivating Tesla in a way he felt no human could replicate. He came to view her as not merely his pet, but a spiritual familiar endowed with an almost human-like soul. The white pigeon would loyally return to Tesla's window each day where he lavished her with affection and shared his innermost thoughts. According to Tesla, on one profoundly moving evening, his beloved companion appeared at his window, her dazzlingly pure white plumage illuminated with an ethereal glow. As Tesla gazed into her shining eyes entranced, he stated the bird spoke to him without words, imparting a mystical revelation from beyond this world. Many regarded Tesla's attachment to his avian friend as yet another unusual eccentricity reflecting his growing detachment from mainstream society. However, Tesla insisted no mere pet could compare to the cosmic closeness and contemplative understanding he received from this blessed dove who visited him like an angel. To Tesla, she embodied a profound transcendent insight into the hidden mysteries uniting all conscious beings. Their remarkable bond highlighted the truly expansive empathy residing within Tesla's sensitive soul. While the details of their connection remain enigmatic, the relationship between Tesla and his devoted companion opens a window into the rich inner life of this scientist, who thought and felt in ways far different from his contemporaries. In the pigeon's loving gaze, Tesla perceived profound truths, affirming that even the smallest gestures of kindness towards living creatures can uplift one's own humanity. Number 2. Tesla's Evasion of Military Service In 1879, 
the threat of mandatory military conscription loomed heavily over the young Nikola Tesla. As a youth coming of age in Austria-Hungary, he was expected to serve in the armed forces as was required of all men at the time. However, Tesla harbored a deep aversion to violence and war. The thought of being forced into the army filled him with dread. When the call came to report for duty, Tesla refused to go quietly. Instead, he took matters into his own hands and fled. Tesla embarked on a dangerous journey high into the mountains near the town of Tomengaj. There, he hid from the authorities while purposefully exposing himself to the life-threatening infectious disease cholera. As cholera ravaged his body, leaving him gaunt and depleted, Tesla clung stubbornly to life. After weeks of illness, he emerged frail and thin, weighing a mere 79 pounds on his 6-foot, 2-inch frame. However, his gambit had succeeded. The military now considered him unfit for service. Having evaded the draft through this desperate gambit, Tesla slowly recovered his strength over the coming months. By 1880, he had regained enough vitality to leave Austria-Hungary permanently, first heading to Prague, and later Budapest to pursue his dreams of becoming an electrical engineer. He stood determined to apply his brilliance not towards weapons and war, but towards pioneering new technologies that would help uplift humanity. The calculative risks Tesla took to avoid the military speak profoundly to his pacifist nature. He channeled his intellectual gifts not into advancing warfare, but into cultivating inventions meant to empower daily life. Tesla's contribution would be building a better future, not destroying lives. His harrowing experience fleeing conscription shaped his steadfast commitment to using science solely for the collective good of humankind. Number 1. The Fires of Darkness Like thunderclouds gathering before a storm, misfortune hung heavy over Nikola Tesla's trailblazing work, foretelling the turmoil that was to come. Two catastrophic fires dealt massive blows to Tesla's research over the course of his career. The first struck in 1895 when Tesla's New York laboratory burned down just as he was poised to expand his enterprises. At the time, he was conducting pivotal experiments and housing invaluable equipment and notes in the Manhattan lab. Despite firefighters' efforts, everything was destroyed in the raging blaze. The timing of the fire was highly suspicious, coming soon after Tesla had parted ways with his financier J.P. Morgan over creative differences. This led some to speculate about sabotage or arson by corporate rivals or enemies seeking to steal Tesla's work. Tesla himself wondered if the fire had been intentionally set. In any case, the loss was professionally and financially devastating. Decades later, in 1943, another mysterious fire erupted in a New York storage facility just after Tesla's death. Federal agents had rushed to confiscate all his possessions, but then the second conflagration broke out, consuming what remained of Tesla's effects. The timing again seemed suspicious, occurring right as officials were transporting Tesla's belongings, fueling theories that critical materials were purposefully burned. While the true origins of these fires remain uncertain, their destruction deprived the world of Tesla's pivotal research they also reinforced speculations about sinister efforts to sabotage the futurist visionary's work. Though the facts are hazy with time, the fires exemplified the precarious position of Tesla's innovations at the cutting edge of discovery. Besieged on all sides by forces seeking to stand in his light. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.